Audits Bureau tells us tonight that they know that they have a lot of work to do. Right, this comes after two audits question the gang enforcement team's effectiveness. Arvelina Jones sat down for a one-on-one -on -one interview with the police chief and her reactions to the audits. Well, Dan and Jennifer, the audit's main concerns are a lack of transparency and trust. Chief Outlaw tells me she can't comment on what was done before she became chief six months ago, but says she wants to work with the community to improve. We're lacking a little bit more here, and we'll get there, is that trust piece. Trust is the biggest obstacle Portland Police Chief Daniel Outlaw says she has to overcome. Just one of the issues highlighted in two audits from the city detailing concerns with the Bureau's gang enforcement team. Anything that we can do to improve how we provide those services, that's what we're committed to doing. Those words come after the audit was released by the city Wednesday, outlining concerns with the team, including using minor traffic violations to stop known gang members. Stops average six times in a shift in 2016, mostly happening in areas with a high black population. And the audit officers say those stops prevent crimes. But the audit says there is no documentation to prove that. We needed to do a better job with documenting. Um, and not only doing that for having better accountability to the public and being transparent, but to make sure that our actions were impactful and effective. Despite the Bureau ending their longtime list of gang members last year, a separate audit also found they have continued to keep a list of most active gang members. A tool Outlaw says helps identify both gang members and those at risk for retaliation. Outlaw says the department is already working on implementing new policies, but says gaining the community's trust will take time. It's not an adversarial relationship. Um, we want to make sure that we're utilizing contemporary policing practices and that everyone's a partner at the table. Now the Portland Police Union is defending the Bureau, calling the audit quote narrow. We will have their full comments on our website, coin.com. Felina Jones, thank